appreciate you guys for stopping in. I just wanted to talk about a couple of things. I'm not going to keep you that long, but I do think that I'm going to turn Tokyo Ghoul into a Patreon exclusive, and it's not because I want to paywall stuff. I've just heard that some YouTubers have gotten strikes for it. Now, when I search it, I can still see that there's a bunch of YouTubers with reactions up. So I'm not sure if the people that got strikes got hit by the automated system because they didn't edit the video enough. If the company itself seeks out videos and just happen to find those channels and give them strikes or if something got copyright claimed and they disputed it because that has happened to me before. I didn't realize how serious they take it and I disputed an anime song in one of my reactions and they denied it and 10 minutes later striked my video down. So I've learned do not dispute anything when it comes to this anime stuff because you put yourself at risk. So if that was the case, I just wouldn't dispute anything and it'd probably be fine, but I don't know who it was that got strikes. I don't know the reason behind it. I, I really don't know anything. So I don't want to put my channel at risk. So in the meantime, I put up a community post with a poll asking if people wanted One Punch Man, Blue Lock, Parasite the Maxim, or Goblin Slayer. And I'll upload that in place of Tokyo Ghoul on YouTube for now, along with well, I forget what else we're going to be doing. We're going, I'm going to be doing Chainsaw Man on here after Vinland Saga ends. So those will be the two that I upload mainly. And then obviously we have Kaiju number eight on Saturday, Demon Slayer on Sunday. So we'll rock with those shows for now until I can find out who it was that got strikes and learn a little bit more about why they got the strikes. And if it seems like it's something that's easily avoidable, I'll go back to uploading it here on YouTube. But I just, I don't want to take the risk. I'm going to have to be a little bit more careful about it. So in the meantime, patreon.com slash Dwayne does anime if you want to follow the Tokyo Ghoul. Hopefully at some point in the future, I'll be able to get it up, but I will replace it with another anime for now. So we'll still keep going strong with the other stuff that we got that I feel comfortable putting up. So I appreciate you guys. Um, obviously uncut, unedited stuff for all the anime that we do on here is up there as well. But otherwise we'll be posting here to YouTube. And I just wanted to let you guys know why I'm going to be most likely making that change because I don't think I'm going to figure it out in the next day or two before the next upload is. So I'm going to have to get those edited and uploaded and sort all this out, which kind of sucks because I'm ahead. Like I have, I think the first six or seven ghoul episodes uploaded, edited for YouTube, all of that stuff. And I have absolutely nothing else ready. So I'm going to have to take some time this weekend to prepare and try to get ahead of the game again. But anyways, if you guys know of anyone that's gotten a strike for Tokyo Ghoul, I appreciate you letting me know because it makes it a lot easier. I could just reach out to them, try to get a response and see what it was that they did or what happened and find out the best way to move forward. So take it easy, stay safe. I'll catch you in the next one, homies.